Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Persona Q! I'm the Musical Gamer, and thanks to all of you for letting me know, there is a feature I overlooked that I actually had no idea existed. If you go into your system settings and configuration, you can actually put on auto mapping, which means that the game will actually automatically draw in floors and walls for you. I don't know if that, um, oh, no, 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 confirm. Uh, I don't know if that means they'll put in, like, symbols, like, for doors and chests and all that other stuff, and apparently I missed a chest somewhere down the- Oh, I think that's the spot right there. Like, I'm looking right at it. I'm pretty sure that is the- Yeah, I think the treasure box just opened. So I am pretty sure that's where the treasure chest was. I can go back and check at a later point, but that is that. So I don't think the auto mapping will put in any icons per se. So we'll still be in charge of like drawing in the shortcuts or putting the doors and treasure boxes and all that other stuff down and any other markings we might want to make, but the walls and floors themselves will fill in, which will be really nice. It will make things quite a bit less complicated. So thank you all for pointing that out to me because I had no idea that feature existed. Anyway, we are still exploring this place, so let us keep doing so, and yeah, look at that, the walls are filling in. That is fantastic. It's presence. Is it an FOE? Uh, it, oh, I see it on the map. Oh, yep, yeah, there he is, that son of a bitch. Oh, God, never mind. This way. Now, there is an annoying thing. You can see up the top right-hand corner of the bottom screen, there's a, um, map, a walking percentage thing. Basically, you need to step on every tile in order to get 100%. And this is true. Uh, ooh, we need to put down a door marker right there. And boop. There we go. Very, very nice. Um, so it does look like we'll have to draw in... Hold on a second. It does look like we'll have to draw in walls that for places we can't exactly walk to. Keep, ooh, where's the, um, aha! I think we could break through that wall up ahead. Let's give it a try. Please be careful! Wait, there's a shadow? Uh, n n n no. D don't, don't do it. <laughs> do not do it, not just yet. Holy crap, there's a shadow back there? Um, shortcut. And of course, do that. So now we have that appropriately marked. We'll come back to that later. I would like to see what's down over here first. Other than a random battle. There are three shadows. All right, Peter, that's done. Are you okay? It looks like you're exhausted. Yeah, just a bit, Fuka. Uh, we're gonna need to go back and heal. I found a peace box. Very sure. That sounds so wrong when you say that, <laughs> Ray. You found a peace pot. Great. I don't see any toilets around here, do you? Oh God. All right, well, we'll mark that too. So basically, we don't need to mark anything on the map other than like points of interest, which works for me, to be totally honest. So I don't need to go. I do not need to go back and draw in all these walls like I thought I had to. So let's check this spot. Mushroom page. Mushroom page. No, no battle. Please, no battle. Ah, uh, ooh. ooh, this is a risk. Do we do it or do we not? Hey, a tart page! Cool! That's gonna bring some interesting stuff for us. Uh, we're about to run into another battle. Do we have... Because I am out of MP at the moment. Everybody else is okay, though. Just me. This is a medicine on Junpei. That's about it. We'll save Yukari's SP for the time being. I said MP, didn't now I? God damn it. Like Let's do that on you. Uh, fire blast, or is that fusion blast? Fusion blast, not fire blast. This isn't Pokemon. I wish I had fire blast in Pokemon, God damn it! Make things so much easier. Uh, I guess you've got- are these things weak to win? Do we know? We don't know anything, so you know what? Try it. Use Garu on them. Because Lord knows, it might actually work. Let's give these guys a good little whack. Zeo will do some nice damage. Are they weak to wind? 
They are not, but you are dead, so it does not matter. Nice, good, good work there, guys. Holy crap. I'm surprised we've managed to kick these guys' ass so well so far. Enemy is weak to bash just rush Good. the rest of this. Let's keep wearing them down. There we go. Nice one. Good. They're dead. Right, Ain't no Peter. thing but a chicken you wang. Count on you. I enjoy getting all the loot because I can sell it and make some money. Peter, are you okay? It looks like you're exhausted. Just a tad There's there, definitely Fuka. Definitely something there. Put that door there. Um. Ooh, what's this? Something on the ground at the end of the passage. Hmm? It's a box. <laughs> Very good, Ray. Looks suspicious, those bright colors. Fuka, do you sense anything from it? Mm. I'm not sensing anything strange in particular. I see. <laughs> oh, you guys. This is one of those things. You know, a magic box. Oh, no, Junpei, where are you going with this? Huh? Have you totally lost it? <laughs> Dude, at least try to hear me out before you roll your eyes. Ahem. Ray-chan, try putting your corn dog in it. Uh, okay. <laughs> Alright, so you all saw her put it in there, right? Now let's give it a spin, and when you open the lid... Ta-da! Surprise, the corn dog is now extremely legit. Did you just steal her corn dog? What? Wow! Oh, wait. There's two of them. Huh? Indeed, there were two corn ducks in the pot. You've just magically solved world hunger, Junpei. I don't know whether to be impressed or kind of scared. <laughs> oh. Even Junpei has a special skill. <laughs> Call me Junpei the Mysterious Grand Illusion. God damn it, Junpei. I should really make like a damn it Junpei counter for this series. I swear. I was thinking about that earlier, because it's Junpei, after all. So what can we put in this box? Put a medicine in it, sure. Hey, there's now two medicines. Yay! Hmm. A net profit for us. I guess so. Can we do it again? I guess we can do it again. Why do I have a feeling I should be saving this? Hmm. I wonder how this thing works. <laughs> you know, for, for people who summon personas by shooting a gun at their frickin' heads, I wouldn't imagine magic would be the strangest thing to think of. Why do I feel like that we should be using this for something else? Now well, I'm just gonna keep doing it. Oh! Oh, the medicine is gone. Really? Put it back to you, mate. <sighs> I see. God damn it, Junpei, don't do this. What? Hey! <laughs> don't drag me into this. Too late. We should leave it be. No telling what it'll do anymore. So we, we basically net profited, I think, one medicine from that whole thing. Which I guess is something. Not the worst thing, I suppose. Uh, oh! Bling! Junpei has found the stairs! They're the stairs! Let's just... Mark this real quick. And put the stair icons... Boop! Like so. Very nice. If you guys wonder why you can't, like, if... It's a treasure I ever box. can't be s heard... I wonder if there's some delicious food inside! But, oh, God, what the f- there. It's an enemy shadow. Just one. Uh, Sorry. Really, only I'm one? Let's keep attacking. Too. Can we just... Yeah, let's just rush this. I totally cleaned up there. Good work, guys. Blink and you'll miss it. So, wait a minute. I think this is... Leader, isn't your energy low? Why don't you head back for now? The lock should be, you see, relief, which looks like a map. Oh! Aha! It seems to be reacting to places you haven't been yet. So places we've missed. There are treasure boxes which only open once you've explored- Ah, yeah, the 100% the floor boxes. Yeah, it is true. It is definitely a good idea to get these. Like, at all costs. 
So wait a minute, let's do that again, because I like seeing what I'm doing. Um, we can put that there. Fill in the wall. As well as there. And do that. Okay, good. Everything is set up the way it should be. Doesn't that wall look a little different from the others? Nothing is out of place. We can go through here to open this passageway, which takes us right to the end. What's down the stairs? Chapter 2. It seems this new floor won't be the cakewalk that the last one was. Ray, are you alright? Mm-hmm. There's so many people with me, and you too, Zen. I'm scared, but I'll be okay. I am glad to hear that. I've always been drawn to this place, but I was too scared to explore it. But with everyone helping me, I'm okay coming in. It's a lot of fun. Thank you very much. You have a very odd sense of fun there, Ray. Zen? What's wrong? Does it hurt somewhere? No. I don't really understand. Uh, Ray, will you stay by my side? It yeah, won't now, dude. Mm-hmm. Of course. It feels like they're in their own world. That it does. You think so? Shidorita and I can be kind of like that, too. <laughs> I guess. God damn it, Junpei. Nobody wants to hear your love life. Ugh, what a pain. Man, I gotta get out of here as fast as I can. For Chitarita's sake, too. I hope we can get Raychan and Zenkun out of here quickly, too. That, that would be ideal. Yeah. <laughs> Koromaru's fired up, too. Keep in mind that we need to prioritize getting ourselves out of here first. Oh, right. <laughs> Don't forget the priorities there, Yukari. Suddenly became very quiet. That reminds me. I noticed Raychan and Zankun don't fight with personas. Persona? Oh, yes. You mean the power of the heart you use. It's true that Ray and I cannot use them. I had heard that only persona users can fight against shadows, though. Well, they live someplace where shadows show up. Maybe they just adapted? Can that actually happen? This place itself is irregular. It's hard to distinguish between what's normal and what's abnormal. This experience will be good research material. If we ever get home, that is. In regards to abnormalities, the same could be said about our leader's persona. What you talking about, Aegis? He is capable of wielding countless personas. Yet ever since coming here, he has summoned only Orpheus. Uh, wh wait a minute. That's true. Hold on, a staple in the Persona games is that you're able to change out whatever Persona you want to use. But we haven't been able to do that. You're the only one who can summon other powers? Hmm. That's what makes me special, man. Why not summoning them now? Um, okay, we'll, we'll try. We don't have any ones other than Orpheus. Oh yeah, these blank cards we've been picking up. A blank card? It's beyond me. But if it's a Persona thing, why not ask those blue people? <laughs> those blue people? What is this, Avatar? <laughs> yes. If our leader can no longer shift Personas, it could be a drastic setback in battle. Let's visit the Velvet Room and see what they say, before the battles get any more heated. Uh, let's leave that for later, I suppose. Very well, but let's not forget to do it. Better sooner than later. Hey, don't don't you worry your little, pretty little red head off, Mitsuru. We're gonna probably go back in just a second. I just want to head back up here and take a look at the box again, because it's going to. Okay, so we're just missing areas in those two places, and then we'll be at 100%. And then we can open this treasure chest. I'd like to do that before moving on to the next floor. So now that we have opened up 
this passageway, we can make it back to the entrance very, very quickly. And very, very easily. Which is really, really nice. Um, I'm trying to think. Because we could quickly get back to over here by going up and to the left and up and then down over. So, yeah, we'll do that. That is great. Oh, I'm so glad I went through these areas. So, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, make sure to check me out on Twitter for news and updates pertaining to the channel. As well as, visit my Patreon page, donate if you possibly can, because it helps me do games like this where I need special equipment, as well as specialized games or things. It just helps me do a lot more than what I currently can. So, thank you all for watching. This is The Musical Gamer, signing off. I'll see you guys in the next video.